Well, hello, good evening, everybody. This is Effort EQE3 Enterprises coming at you with a retro review of a sort. Recently, I was thinking about different things I can store all my camera stuff in, which I don't have a whole lot, but if I need to go somewhere and I need a couple of cameras, well, I need a, a go bag of a sort. <laughs> Two quotes instead of one. And I remembered that I bought way hey, back in 2002. I bought this really cool backpack that I never used. Matter of fact, it still has the tags on it. I dug through the shed, and I'll be darned if I didn't find it. And here it is right here. This is a really neat backpack. This is the High Sierra 54301 Suspension Strap System Backpack. And it still has the, start, the tags on it from all those years ago, so... Uh, first of all, it has a lifetime warranty, which is a good thing, so I haven't even used it. Well, I need a backpack with a lot of pockets, and this has a lot of pockets. We'll start off with the strap here as a spot for a GPS or a phone or what have you, or a little bitty tripod, maybe. This little strap here, you probably put stuff in. But... And of course, we have pouches and pouches and pouches and pouches. This one up here, there's a little place for an MP3 player or a CD player or whatever. It has a, a hole right here for the headphone cord to go through. And there's another little pouch down here for all the little things you might want to carry. And of course the big place right here, there's two compartments you can open. This one's just a big spot. There's no other pockets in here, but my DSLR camera fit well in here. <coughs> my laptop would go in there if I needed it. My teleprompter, if I had to wrap it in something, it's just two picture frames <laughs> taped together. And here's a pouch for where the MP, MP3 player or whatever would go. A CD player might fit in there. But... And of course, down here, Another pouch, and here's the thing to hang keys or whatever other equipment. Down here is where all the fun is. There's all kinds of pockets and pockets and zipper pockets and front of pockets. And there's tons of places to store stuff. Of course, here's the thing for your keys. You have, to have it zipped inside, and this is just for extra equipment. Here, I'll take some pictures of the inside of this so you can see it, but there's just tons of pockets and stuff in here. And of course, here's a second big compartment right here. Yeah. And that's just another extra bigger compartment. Here's the other little storage thing on the front of that one. Miscellaneous stuff. I can put me a little tripod and stuff in here. It's just another big open. So this is really cool. And down here, what I really like, these two straps on the bottom. In the pictures, it shows a bedroll, but I could put my, tri my full size tripod or something else down here, too. Ooh, kinky. <laughs> there you go, and you can see how many places this has. Down in here, you get little bitty pockets and pockets. There's a zipper pocket with a pocket, you have two pockets behind it, and a button. There's tons of storage in here. A smaller open area here for whatever. And a bigger one here for the bigger stuff on this. Huh? And this is just a really, really cool backpack. I'm glad I bought it. I never use it, like you noticed. <laughs> the tags are still on it from 2002. It's brand new. I uh, suggested re retail back then was $70, but I got it on clearance at Walmart for like $20-$25 and they're still selling it on, and you can find it on Amazon for $25-$35, <laughs> which is a good deal. This is an excellent backpack. And the straps are good for comfort. You know, got this up here for to sit on your shoulders. It's really, really comfortable. And other places to hook stuff in here. And, and of course, oh, I almost forgot. These little pouches over here, you can put a tiny tripod in here, or a lens maybe. I don't know if you want to put a lens in this mesh, because it could get bumped around, but if it's in a, if in a case, it could fit in there, or a water bottle, or whatever, and there's one on both sides. See? And of course, these straps here help secure things so they don't bounce around. These straps here, you can tighten them so things don't you know, pop around in there. But this is an excellent backpack. This is going to be my go bag, until such time as I have too much stuff. I don't know about not this on the end of the the shoulder straps. I guess let's keep it from coming out of the out of the whatever this thing is called. <laughs> well, you could probably hang something in there too if you really wanted to. But this is gonna be my go bag till such time as I have too much stuff to put in and need a bigger one or a better one. But 
for now this is going to be perfect. Mm. I love you back. <laughs> so, I hope you appreciate this video. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you didn't like it, thumbs down it. I appreciate you leaving comments down below and hitting the mash and the like button. And subscribing to my channel, watching more videos and sharing my videos and sharing my channel. And also check out my vlog channel, which is Effort Kiwis. <laughs> no down quotes again. And I have some interesting, exciting vlogs there. Not really. But I'm working on it. So I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Take care, YouTubers.